welcome back dear friends inside this class we are going to discuss about direction property so open your core editor go to file menu and save us this file to create a separate file by giving the name direction dot html and save this file now you can just remove all this extra text from the body this the body closing text you can just select from here till here and you can just remove all this also from style tick and here you can just save this and launch your file in the browser so css text properties not text properties css direction properties direction we are all properties you can save and now come here and refresh css direction properties so here i'm just going to insert a heading 2 inside this i'm just writing hi and welcome to css3 course can just save this come here and refresh so here we can select the heading to this car selector you can give a background color background color you can say just uh, something like orange you can define a width for this something maybe like 800 pixel also you can define a height something like 70 px and you can just save now come here and refresh so inside this class the topic is direction it means the direction of the text from which side you want to apply the text by default it is left to right so i'm just going to write here direction so you can say l t r so ltr means i'm just writing here inside comments ltr is stand for left to right so ltr means left to right you can save and refresh so there is no changes you can see but if you are writing here instead of ltr you can just write here something this called right to left so this called rtl save and refresh now you can see now this time the text just come from here hi and welcome so this is good for if you are creating a website and you are writing text in other languages just without language because in english language uh, we are writing the text from left to right but uh, there are some other languages that you need to write the text or you need to write the paragraph from right to left it means i'm just writing this one also rtl is stand for right to left right to left so this is the different so as i told in some of the languages if you are creating a website in other languages like it can be urdu it can be hindi or it can be arabic or persian so in these languages you need to write uh, the text the paragraph from right to left so that's why uh, you can use the direction to rtl so this all there is nothing else about direction so what is your task what can you do till the next class so you can just uh, open a heading tag here inside the body you can open a div tag you can open a paragraph tag even you can write a paragraph then you can just apply any properties inside css that you know but you must apply the direction property once you can just apply l to r it means left to right and you can apply rtl right to left so this is your task till uh just coming classes or till the next class you need to do this 
and have a nice time and see you